Good morning, everyone. One of the highlights and focus points of the holiday of Shavuos is the Jewish people receiving the Aser Sadibros from Hashem, the Ten Commandments from God. Now, we don't have, we're not giving a whole class on this, but I just want to home in on one idea of the Aser Sadibros. So the commentaries say really that the Aser Sadibros are split into two categories of five. Now we have this idea in Judaism that there's two types of mitzvot. There are mitzvot between Adam le Makom, between man and God, like shaking the lulav, hearing the shofar, and others. And then there are mitzvot called ben Adam le Chaviriyo, between man and his fellow. Lashon Hara, Tzedakah, honoring one's parents, not hurting other people. So there's two different categories of mitzvot. And say the commentaries that within the Aseret Sedibros, these Ten Commandments, really all of the 613 mitzvahs are hidden, and we don't have time to go into that in their morning minute. But the commentaries explain that God, Hashem, divided into two categories of five these two different types of mitzvot, between man and God. I am Hashem, your God. Don't have idols. Keeping the Shabbos. And then the latter five, are between man and his fellow. Honor one's parents, don't kill, don't steal. And the commentaries tell us that the point of this is to remind us that it's as important to keep the mitzvahs between man and his fellow as to keep the mitzvahs between man and God. And it's as important to keep the mitzvahs between man and God as it is to keep the mitzvahs between man and his fellow. We all have different ones that we are feel more connected to. Some people, it's easier to keep the mitzvahs between man and God. And for other people, it's easier to keep the mitzvahs between man and his fellow. Now, Sarah Sadibras are teaching us and reminding us that all the 613 mitzvahs fall into these two different categories. And we have to be as strong, we have to be as committed to the mitzvahs between man and God as we are to man and his fellow. If it's easier for one to keep the mitzvahs between man and God, and if it's easier for someone to keep the mitzvah between man and his fellow, we have to be as committed as keeping the mitzvah between man and God as it is keeping the mitzvah between man and his fellow. So let's think about these categories and let's think about which one is easier for us and then work on the other category to make sure that we are able to truly connect to all the mitzvahs that Hashem gave us. And that's hidden in that Sarah Sedibros. Wishing everyone a beautiful day.